Hey my gators, today I'm gonna to show you how to hang a hanging plant. And I love the hanging plant concept. Why? Because it saves so much space. Now we have this plant here, back here with this, which is a pothos. And it has a stand and so everything has to be in front of it because the stand is taking up space. So we're going to move that um, plant and we're gonna hang it up in this nice, beautiful planter. And these are the things you're gonna need. You're gonna need a drill to drill uh, just a mini hole to get started. You're going to need anchors because you want something that's going to hold some weight. Even though the plant is not that heavy, why not overkill it? These are called self-drilling um, anchors and these are the best you can use. You don't have to worry about those little thin flimsy ones that don't pop out. These actually, you can make the hole and drill it in. I would suggest using a Phillips, but with this way that we're doing it today, you can actually take the hook that you're going to be putting the planter um, on and screw it in and it'll continue to let the actual piece go up inside of the wall. So that's how we're going to do it today. And I have a beautiful planter, hanging planter, and it's this right here, black macrame, and it has black wood um, beads on it so beautiful so and I also have this I want to change the basket to go with the flow of my um, Zen slash meditation room office and so we're gonna switch all that up so let's get into it I want to start off by drilling just a little hole just a little hole to get that started like that I'm putting mine on the Phillips and I'm going to stick it in and push it in. And I'm going to utilize this to get in there. I don't want to make the hole too big. We can make it just a dab bigger. Just a dab. Oof, so I'm going to take my drill and get it started. And I wanted to make sure that Phillips will go in. So I'm going to take the drill, get it started. Hold on, let me grab the drill. So the drill, see how it self drills in? Oh, I didn't even have to use the Phillips. So then I'm gonna take this hook and this is going to continue the drilling in. And this is going to ensure, I mean, when I say it is tight trying to screw this in, yeah, this bad boy is tight. <laughs> Technically, ugh. It's good, let's see. All right, let's put the plan on. Planner is hanging. It is that simple, let's get the plan in. I wanted to make sure this will fit, and it does, so now I'm gonna put my plan in. Doesn't that look beautiful? And these are 23 inches, and so I'm gonna cascade the rest of the plant over that way, and now it's gonna give it more room to cascade over there. Look how gorgeous, look how gorgeous. I'm in love. And that's how you do a hanging planter. I'm gonna adjust this a little bit. Uh, make sure it's in the middle. It's a circle under here, so if you make sure that circle is directly in the middle, then you know that your plan will be standing straight. It looks crooked in the video, but it's actually not. I don't know why, but yeah. That's how you hang a hanging macrame planter um, holder. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you thumbs up the video, share the video, and talk to me in the comments because I talk back. I am a plant mom, as you can see. <laughs> and I love plants and I love everything with plants and the beauty that they bring to your home and how they filter your home as well. Lady Gators.